I saw Rajesh perform in Llanabutha in a little church hall uh, in a band called Magic Carpet a long time ago. He was just doing a sound check and he did the squeeze of the harmonium and he sang a bit in the microphone. I was like, oh my God, is this for real? Is this man really in this room singing with that voice? Eventually we began um, being able to discuss how we were going to make work and, and, uh, and we did, luckily we did begin meeting up and discussing ways of working and things that inspired us. Luckily we did, we did do that work before lockdown so that was a blessing. So that's how we met. I, I really love to collaborate with different musicians and uh, work with other artists and especially of different styles and different genres. And somehow my my interest is in trying to find that common ground between uh, my music, my voice, and other musicians, and how we can really work together and and bring something different out of each other's uh, uh, music. I always wanted to um, uh, try out uh, experimenting with my voice and my singing and the sound of the harp, and and and, and I wanted to do that. And somehow in Stacy, I found that person. I thought that if Stacy could uh, uh, could agree to work with me, it would be fun to experiment these several several ideas. And 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 at that time, I was absolutely not sure what what ideas were, but I just knew that that there could be some meeting point between our uh, our styles, our uh, our influences, our music, and so on. Mona, Ali Mona, Ali Mona, Shai Mareta, Shere Razda, Kuvate Marmaritika. When I first started um, working with uh, the music that Rajesh is so, um, you know, is so qualified and so talented in, he would give me these, uh, these riffs, these tiny elements, these little motifs you know, rhythms and scales and counting and phrasing that I had never played, you know, I just had never played anything like it. And I remember trying to get the timings right and the counting and the, you know, like, and now I listen back to those phrases that were really quite tough to learn and they all seem like friends now. I listen to the track, every track on the album, and it's like walking with my friends. You know, it's it's a really big deal. I really feel very fortunate that uh, Stacy uh, took the effort to to listen to to some of my compositions and and bring bring those compositions out and and now they now they are now somehow we are working with those compositions uh, and they are in a new light now because now they are they are being uh, they are being matched with some something beautiful in Welsh. And, and when they are coming together, they are getting a new life. It's a new song. It's no longer the old song anymore. It's no longer the old Welsh song. It's no longer the old my song. But it's a new song where these two, two, two streams have, have met together. We shared all our ideas um, digitally back and forth. And slowly um, forms started to emerge of, of sections that we could um, record our lines together. And then those those sections uh, we then sent off to Ardalan Marchinero, um, who's a wonderful musician and a lovely human being, and he uh, stitched our larger sections together to make the complete whole, to give us the the full the full story. Um, and then we were very very lucky that uh, our dear friend um, Dylan Fowler. He mixed. He then mixed it for us, uh, and then after that, uh, Donald Whelan, who is an absolute genius at mastering, and so the final finished quality 
For me, certainly, I would like the listener to feel they are sitting with us very intimately, sharing something very, very personal. That's, that's how it is for me. various languages like Urdu, Sanskrit and uh, uh, Hindi and uh, and these these languages have come about mainly because of the poetry that I uh, that I selected and and uh, uh, and uh, you know the, the my inspiration came from these beautiful poems uh, the Sufi poems and and some of the some of the uh, excellent uh, mystical poems of from India whenever I want to make a song I just I just put put my hand and try to select one of these poems from 12th century, 13th century and, and onwards. Whenever I look for a song, I want to make a song, I'm looking for lyrics. That's where I go and pick up. Now is un really interesting as well in this because it talks about uh, weaving um, at the close of day at um, dusk uh, and it says there are different colors for different parts of life but all the different colors are woven together as and and there's a lovely line and it talks about ending united in the in the loom and I really love that because it feels like the woven fabric in that poem is like the woven fabric of everything we do as a, as a duo. So I really, I love that. That is the real uh, theme behind behind our music. We are we are bringing together the, the two streams of cultures, the two streams of ideas, the two streams of influence. Just the two of us. <laughs> and maybe that is the reason why we chose to call our album Trabo Dai while we are together you know everything will happen while we are together and and i think that is our real inspiration bringing bringing things together from our own side from our own influences from our heart and somehow when they sit together they get a new life altogether and that's a new music and that is absolutely new it's it's nothing to do with the old this is new music this is the music of gitana No. Oh. 